Are you looking for a Lego idea book? Our kids have been so interested in Legos lately that we decided that it might be a good idea just to kind of open up their creativity to something more than just the instruction manuals that come with all the sets, would be to get them a book of all these different kinds of creations that they can try and create without having the step-by-step. -step. And so I want to show you guys the book that we decided to get them online. First of all, hi. Hi to all the new dads out there. This is Dad Reviews. This is where I give you my unedited, hopefully more authentic look at the products that we like, use, and have, and hopefully we'll keep our kids busy playing with Legos. <laughs> so if you're interested in that, you might want to consider clicking that subscribe button and hit the bell too. That way you actually get notified of our videos. So uh, we've gotten our kids a Lego book before and uh, they actually do take it out and they try to build some of the things in there. My daughter's really good at it. My son really likes kind of a step-by-step -step type of thing. So uh, we decided to try out this book this year. Let me open up this. What I really liked about this book is that um, it has something for every day of the year. It's one of those like uh, 365 type of Lego books. And so let me knife this box open here. My good M Mike Vance there. Let's see, we're gonna open this up right here. Got that R, got that R in there. We don't need that R. Nice hardcover book here too. Let me get rid of that box. Uh, the 365 things to do with Lego bricks. Now, you don't necessarily have to actually use this, you know, one per day. They've just given you different, uh, 365 different things that you can do. So you can turn it into a daily thing if you want to, but uh, it's just a nice, I really like that this is a hardback book because all you know, you know, if you have Legos, all those instruction books that come in the thing, you know those things are torn up in like a week, right? The spines fall, or the, the staples are falling off of the spine. You're losing pages all over the place. Y'all know what I'm talking about. I know you do. So this is a nice hard, uh, hard bound spine, hard cover book right here. So uh, let's see. There's, it seems like there's, it looks like from what I can see here, there's four different things that you can do here and they're kind of color coded by the little dot says go on a lego treasure hunt create and perform lego magic tricks make a lego stop motion movie challenge your friends to build the tallest lego tower okay so those are just some of the ideas i think so let's open this thing up we're going to take a look at what you actually oh wow look at that that's a table of contents of a whole bunch of things that you can do so there's animals and other creatures there's tricks and pranks there's creepy things for sport lovers the multiplayer games, one player games. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I never thought about that. That's such a great idea. Hold on, I'll show it to y'all in a minute. Let's keep, go through more of these chapters. Yeah, group challenges, solo challenges, uh, stylish storage. Oh, so you can make like a storage thing out of Legos. That's such a good idea. Festive fun, party planning, so par party ideas. Brighten up your desk. <laughs> that's fun. Man, there's so many different uh, chapters here. This is a third, six pages. Uh, discover with Lego bricks, get a gift, how to's, get artsy, make a display, puzzles and brain teasers, put on a show, fun things to do with your minifigures, build a micro scale, be organized, get snap happy, make it all about you on the. Mo oh my god, this just keeps going on and on and on. Okay, no, that's all the table of contents there. Okay, so we got to the green page. So there's just, I mean, there's slew and slew if you wanted to start a lego youtube channel you have uh, 365 ideas of different things that you could create right here that is an amazing idea if anybody's into legos but um the thing that i noticed was the uh where is it this right here. My son loves doing, taking uh, these blocks that we have and making like a domino track out of them. And look at this. They show you how to make dominoes right there. Isn't that super cool? I never thought about using Legos as a domino. Or they show you how to make like all these fun boxes and whatnot, different containers. Just looking at some of the things on the cover here. It looks like, like they have these different castles and they have planets. There's a castle, there's the planets, they have a, like a, is that a checkered board or a tic-tac-toe board? Um, a, a, what do you call that, shuffle ball? Like a little shuffle ball game right there. I'd never even thought of some of these. This is such a great idea. So looking at it, it doesn't, it doesn't look like it gives you a step-by-step. But it gives you enough, like the front here, and then it shows you the back, and it gives you uh, some more about the figure that you're creating there. 
uh, this is just a really great idea. Take aim in Tin Can Alley. So like making like a little thing where you can shoot different things at the barrels right here and see how many you can knock down. Uh, spot the difference. So like create two different sets that almost look identical and you have to try and find what's different. These are such great ideas that you can do with your kids. Keep the kitchen clean. So like things you can create out of Legos in your, uh, for your kitchen. Look, it's a paper towel holder. There's a Lego paper towel holder. How cool is that? This is a really neat book. I think I might have some fun with this book as well. If you guys want to check this thing out too, I'll link it up down in the description below. You can go read other people's reviews about it. Don't just take my word for it. I'm just one guy showing it off to you for the first time. Uh, but look, a little puppet, a little Lego puppet, like a, one of those, what do you call those things on the strings? I can't think. It starts with an a marionette. Is that what those are called? A marionette. It's like a pup puppet with the things on top. Um, Super cool. This is, I'm excited to let our kids build some stuff with this. Maybe after they build a few things, I'll come back here and we'll go through the book with them and find out what was some of their fun things, the most fun things that they enjoyed from this book. I should do that with their other book as well. That's a really good idea. If you guys want to see some of the other Lego things that we've gotten for our kids over the years, I'm going to put those right there on the screen. You guys go click those videos. I'll see y'all in those videos. Thank you dads for watching. That thumbs up is always appreciated. Like I said, this is linked up down in the description below and dad out.